Underneath a little bit like that. And then this piece goes on top. We have to try and stand and balance on that. But even that's not dangerous enough for me. So I'm going to do it up on this high platform that I've recently had made for me. So that piece goes on there. And then this piece goes on top a little bit like that. We have to try and stand on there. And I'm going to try and juggle at the same time. So hopefully that's dangerous enough for you. So that'll be the finale of the show. But like I said, I'm going to do a few warm-up tricks. So if we can find it. Warm-up trick number one is going to be the spinning ball. One thing to note during this show, if you see anything even remotely impressive, clap and cheer, make some noise, show some appreciation. It is much appreciated. So let's see if we can practice that. Maybe when I spin the ball on my finger, everybody can clap and cheer, go crazy for it. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, pretty good. I can't help but notice some people weren't doing it. No, that's fine. You've just got higher standards than everybody else. These other lot, they'll clap for any old rubbish. But you guys want to see something more impressive, which is what we're going to do. We're going to use this pole, but even this is a bit more impressive than that because it looks a little bit like that. Yes, there we go. So the trick is spin the ball on my finger, transfer it over to the pole, and then I have to try and balance all of that on my chin. Okay, right, let's make sure this is nice and straight. Here we go. The ball, oh, the ball, hopefully. Onto the finger, there we go. Over to the pole. Here we go. As soon as I do it, clap and cheer one last song. Yes, there we go, just like that. Well, oh, thank you very much. Cool. Okay, the next trick we're going to do is three juggling clubs. Now these are similar to juggling balls, but they're quite a bit harder because you have to spin them like that. So that makes them a little bit more tricky to get used to that spin. I'll tell you what, I'm very important. I'm just going to take my jacket off. Um, we'll just throw that one down there. Okay, so the three juggling clubs. So we can do them with single spins a little bit like this. Or we can do double spins high up in the air a bit like that. Or we can even not spin them. This is actually a very difficult trick flat a bit like that, or you can do some columns straight up and down like this, into a triple spin, oh there we go, a bit like that, we'll do a few other quick tricks, once like this, and let's do a difficult one, let's do under the arms, hip chops over the top, a bit like that, oh thank you very much, okay, but do you want to see a really difficult trick, yes, okay, do you want to see three clubs under the leg, Yes, okay, here we go. Three clubs under the leg in three, two, one. Just like that, there we go. No, okay, the, the adults are clapping, the kids do not look in place. Let's do it properly. Uh, the fancy start, there we go. Okay, we'll do a few practice ones, then we'll do all three in a row. So we'll do a practice one, one under there, one under that side, one under that side. Okay, I think we're warmed up. Now we'll do all three in a row, here we go. One, two, three. One, four, a bonus one. There we go, just like that. Oh, thank you very much. Let's put the clubs away. Now, for the next trick, I do actually need somebody in the audience to come and help me. I don't know if there's anybody. What about you there? You put your hand up very quickly. Do you want to come out and help me? That'll be great. You can maybe come round there. That'll be perfect. Give a massive round of applause for coming out. What's your name, for me? Say that again, sir. Harkirits. Everyone give Harkirits a massive clap for coming out to my volunteer. Okay, right, I'm going to give you my hat there. You can wear that. Oh, hello, I can't even put it on. Have you got a bigger head than me? That's, have you got a bigger head than me? That's impressive. There we go. Right, uh, no, you don't have mitts, do you? No, okay, well, you do now, anyway. That, I'm only joking. That's just a joke. Okay, I need five juggling balls, because uh, you're going to juggle five balls for me. You can do that. No, no, don't worry. I'm going to juggle the five balls. Uh, to, to explain how difficult this is, uh, five balls took me a whole year to learn, practicing every single day for a whole year. I've got really juggled four balls a whole year just to juggle five balls, so that's really, really difficult on its own. But if you could just hold the hat out for me in both hands, perfect. I'm going to juggle all five balls, and they're going to throw them up one at a time, and hopefully you're going to catch all five in the hat in a row, and you guys are going to clap and cheer, so absolutely crazy. Okay. When we do the trick, okay. so you put the hat down low, don't forget to lift it up to catch me. 
I'd like you to move it around a little bit. My aim isn't quite that good, especially when I'm looking up there juggling five balls. So let's just do a quick practice one. It should be a little bit like this in three, two, one. Yeah, so they give a big clap for that. to tell you the practice one, but it's a very good clap. Okay, right, here we go. With the five juggling balls. I mean, I'm juggling five balls, everybody. And the funny thing is I can actually juggle five balls for open and you guys can clap for apparently. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Okay. Right, here we go. Are you ready? The first ball coming to you in three, two, one. Yes! Okay, the second one in three, two, one. Yes! Very nice. Now we'll do the last three in quick succession, one after the other. Here we go in three, two, one. There's three. There's four. And there's all five in a row. Oh, very nice production. I'm just glad that. We just give a nice big bow to the audience. Give a one last massive round of applause. That was amazing. First try. You can go and sit down for me. That was great. First try. Not everybody does that first try. Now, before I move on from the, from the juggling balls, you don't want to see me try and do six juggling balls, do you? Yes. I'll try and see if I can do six. Now, I do mean try. I can't always do this, because this is very, very hard. Uh, and it's taken years to learn. And to explain how it works, because I think it's quite interesting, the balls don't actually cross over, they stay in each hand. So I have to do three balls in one hand, a bit like that, which is very hard on its own. If anybody's tried juggling three balls in two hands, you can probably imagine how hard that is to do in one. And we have to do three balls in the other hand. We have to do that at the same time. So this is very hard and I can't always do it, but we're going to give it a go. So can you guys help me out for this one and give me a count of three all together. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, okay, we did say that might happen. We did say that might happen. It just makes it all the more impressive when I do it second try because I've made it look hard. Here we go. The count of three again. Ready? One, two, three. Yes! There we go. The sixth ball, second try. We'll take that. We'll take that. Okay, right, what else should we do? We've got this thing over here. I think we should use this. Um, but I don't really know what you do with it. Do, do I play it like this? Is that right? No? What, what do I have to do? Just as a kid, sh shout out for me. Sit on it. Okay. Do I sit on it like this? Is that right? No? What's wrong? What do I have to do? I have to sit on the seat. Right? Oh. There we go. Am I good? No? Yes? Or do I have to stand it up? Is that right? And then, oh, that's a change. It's a bit very easy, is it? No, okay, I've got it. I think maybe I have to. We'll just put it like this. Again. No, 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 no. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Let's not do that. Okay, let's try like this. And then I just ride it, do I? Let's ride it, do I? Okay, let's give it a go. Okay, let's get another count of three for me, and then we'll try and ride it. Here we go. One, two, three. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I think I'm doing it. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. oh, that is scary. Oh, I can't scare you guys over here. You're protected by a netting. I'll ride it nicely then. Here we go. Oh, hello over there. You're looking at the back of me all show. All uh, right, here we go. So then we can do some other tricks. We can see if we can ride it backwards. Oh, that's a difficult trick. Oh, oh if we go back into the middle. This is a trick in itself where we rock backwards and forwards. This is called idling. It's actually harder than riding around, it may look easier, but it's actually harder. And it's how we stay still in one spot, you have to keep rocking backwards and forwards. But what we can do while doing this, is to try and ride with just one foot. Very hard trick, here we go, one wheel, one foot. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, thank you very much. But the core trick that everyone wants to see is some jumps, some bunny hops, a bit like this. Or some big ones. Or we'll even try a 360, a spin a bit like that. But before I finish on here, do you want to see me juggle on the unicycle at the same time? Yes. Okay, let's see if we can give that a go. So we're going to try and juggle three juggling clubs while riding the unicycle. Years and years to learn this. It's a trick I really wanted to learn. It just looks so cool. <laughs> can we get a nice slow hand clap, everybody? At the same time, here we go. There we go, that's better. Yes! There we go. 
juggle on it at the same time but I want you guys to choose what you want to see me juggle so do you either want to see me juggle three juggling clubs or would you like the other option we can find them which is three of these okay in one second give me a cheer for the option that you want anybody for the nice safe plastic juggling clubs a few people or anybody for the very scary knives I still couldn't quite tell. Anybody for the clubs? Anyone for the knives? Oh dear. Okay. You just want to see me hurt myself. You sick people. Okay. They are metal. They are sharp. They do hurt if you catch the wrong end. I have tried that. That doesn't go very well at all. But I'll tell you what, just to prove to you that these are sharp, because I feel like some of you don't believe me. I'm going to put that one down. I'm going to use something else which is in fact an apple. We're going to do a bit of fruit ninja. Does anybody remember that game? Where you have to try and slice the fruit. So if I can just ask for a quick hand. Uh, what about you, sir? Could you just tax this one for me? Well, we just check that's a normal apple. No, it took about a perfect. Now, I'd like to throw it back to me. I'll tell you when. <laughs> Let's try that one again. Here we go. Okay, I'm going to throw this one to you. Now, if you could just hold on to it for a second. And in one moment, I'm going to get you to throw it up here. I need a nice looping throw up into my hand here. Because I'm going to be about to throw the knives and go into a juggle. Yours is the first throw on the juggle. Okay, I'm ready when you're on. Well, amazing. Give a big clap for that throw. Very nicely done, sir. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going to move back from you guys. I don't want the apple flying into the audience. Now, as I say, the trick is while juggling, throw the apple up and slice it in half. Here we go, in three, two, one. We missed. Okay, let's try again. Here we go, second try. I'll throw it up myself. Here we go. Come on. Here we go, in three, two, one. We sliced a very, very small piece off. That's not enough. We took the smallest of pieces off. Here we go. We want a nice clean slice straight through the middle. Third time lucky, fourth time embarrassing. Okay, here we are. We've dropped the knife. Okay, that doesn't count as an attempt. Here we go. Come on now, focus. In three, two, one. Yes! There we go, two clean pieces. Oh, the third attempt. There we are, one half there. And one half like that. Does anybody want any apple? No, no, I probably wouldn't. It's been all over the floor. Let's not eat that one. Okay, right. Put that one there. Now, for now, we talk. now quickly before I do that, I will just need another quick hand from the people in the audience. And that was a great throw, sir. Could you just put your hand straight up in the air for a second like that? That's great. Who else should we have? What, what about you, sir? Could you just do the same? Just put your hand straight up like that. Just hold them there for one second. Right, now for the finale of the show, I do actually need two brave volunteers. Oh, look at that. They're so keen. The hands went straight up. Do you guys mind coming out and helping me? That'd be amazing. Give them a round of applause, my brave volunteers. Thank you very much. What's your name, sir? Uh, just a minute. Can we just hang on a minute there? I would like to put out an announcement for Rajni with all volunteers to go down to the main stage. Please, four volunteers to the main stage, please. Thank you, sir. Yes. Volunteer for the main stage. Okay, so right, that was Nathan, wasn't it? Everyone say hi, Nathan! Perfect, and your name, sir? Martin, everyone say hi, Martin! Perfect, right, now I'm thinking, if I just grab these. Um, Martin, that was a great throw to me before. If you could just hold those, or obviously not the sharp end. And then if one, in one second, if you could just climb up there and juggle them for me, that'd be great. No, okay, don't worry. You're going to need to throw the knives up to me, because I need my hands to get up here nice and safely you're going to throw the knives up to me and that means you Nathan get a rather fun job because that means you need to lie underneath 
Don't worry, you don't have to lie directly on the ground. I do actually have a nice towel for you to lie on. So you can be nice and comfy down there while you risk your life for me. I'll lay that out nicely for you. If you wouldn't mind just lying down there on your back. I am serious, yes. Oh, there we go. He's going down. What a brave man. You don't know if I can do this yet. Well, the YouTube video I watched last night made it look quite easy, so hopefully we'll be able to do this. Okay, now you do actually need these safety goggles. We'll give you these. They look great if you can pop those on for me. Oh, they look lovely. Now, they may look like they've got a few scratches on them. There's, there's no reason for that at all. Um, okay, so one second. I'm going to juggle the knives up here over my brave volunteer. But I'm just thinking I want to do one last bonus trick. Do you want to see one last bonus trick? Yes, okay. I'm going to try and see if I can juggle not one, not two, not three, not four, but in fact five juggling clubs. I just want to show you this because it has taken so many years of my life, years and years without any social life, just to juggle five clubs. Uh, and to really give you an idea how difficult this is, there are only around ten people that can do this. Ten people in the whole of the UK that can juggle five clubs. So this really is difficult. Uh, so I may not do it first try, I may drop them. So I'll tell you what, Martin, if I drop one, could you distract them all for me? Just do a little dance or something. That, that'd be great. Okay, here we go. The five juggling clubs. Oh no, I dropped one. Oh, look at that. Thank you very much. Sorry, that was very mean. Are you alright down there, Nathan? You comfy? We'll get to you in one second. Okay, here we go. The five clubs, and then we'll get on to the finale of the show. Just like that, first try. You didn't mean to do the dance again. I'm sure you're very pleased about that, Martin. Okay, right. Here we go. Uh, I tell you what, I do actually need my box just to help me climb up onto this platform here. So we're going to place that one there. A bit like that. I tell you what, I want to get a nice slow hand clap going for the finale of the show. So what about every time my foot touches the ground, I'd like everybody to clap once. Here we go. Let's see if we can do that. Good. Good. Not so good, pay attention. Here we go. There we go. Okay, that was a big build up from now something very slow. So I need to get up here very carefully. stepping up for one second for me because Martin's about to throw me those knives and while I trust myself throwing the knives over you I don't quite trust Martin's throws yet so if you could just stand right in front of me there and then I just need a knife and I just need a nice push up into my hands here not here or anywhere down there okay please throw me knife number one love it oh sorry that is actually knife number two <laughs> not any numbers okay knife number two please Whoa, thank you very much I'm knife number three thank you very much give me a massive round of applause very nicely done, Martin. You can run out of the danger zone. You can run for your life. Okay, but unfortunately, Nathan, if you don't mind getting back down there. There we go. Oh. Okay, right. Grand finale time. Now, I have to say before I do it, please do not try this at home. This is very, very dangerous. And to be honest, quite stupid. Uh, and this trick can go very, very horribly wrong. But I have to say, I have only ever got this trick wrong once. So I'm really happy to be trying it for the second time today. No, okay, I can't really, I, I can't really do it. Okay, here we go. Get up, one, two, four, one. Oh, okay, we're up. Okay, one last time, everybody, a nice slow hand clap. All at the same time. Come on, everybody this time. Here we go. Yes! There we go! Oh. Oh. Just like that! Yeah. Oh. Do you want to jump up for me? Give them a massive round of applause instead of one piece! Oh. Okay, um, how do I get down? Um, I, think, I think we'll put this down there and then we'll jump down 